What's going on guys? Back at it again with a much anticipated series here on my channel. Anticipated mainly for me, but you know what? I am very excited to start the first DLC for the Fallout 3 franchise or series. And that is of course on Broken Steel. Now I debated on whether or not I wanted to do Broken Steel or uh, Operation Anchorage first. Operation Anchorage obviously being the first DLC and uh, Broken Steel being the first one after that uh, the main campaign. Obviously, this is where I ended the series before. So I decided to do Broken Steel first only because it's basically the continuation of the main story. Uh, and it takes place literally right after the game ended. So I decided to do this game uh, DLC first before anything else only because of that very reason but believe me when I'm telling you I really struggled between uh, Operation Anchorage and Broken Steel as far as which game uh, uh, DLC I wanted to do first here on the channel but I ended up with this one so let's go ahead and just get started man I'm very excited to get into this you know first DLC seen as I've been wanting to play it for quite some time already but of course there's a lot of games that I want to play and unfortunately I just didn't get around to this one quite yet but this is it part one of the Broken Steel DLC if you're excited for this video or this small little DLC series do me a huge favor drop a like on this video also subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed because it really does help this channel grow so with that being said let's get to this all right so it says the first part of this mission, if I remember correctly, is that we need to talk to uh, Scrub, uh, Scribe Rothschild. Uh, quest, uh, Death from Above, speak to Scribe Rothschild. Yep, absolutely correct. We, I forgot that we have Fox with us. I, had hoped you'd return. I didn't mean to talk to you. Uh, yeah, let's get going. No. There we go. Get out of my way, dog meat. Oh my god. <laughs> Already starting this off with getting stuck on things. Where is Scribe Rothschild? Do we have to leave here? I think we do. Alright, get out of my way, Fox. You're an amazing, amazing companion. But you know what? You're always in my way, bro. That's you. That's just the truth. Where are we going? Is it is it this way? Yeah. Alright. It's been a very long time since I played this game. Literally since I completed the series here on the channel. And you know what? I'm so stoked to be finally playing this. I'm pretty much already, like, suited and ready. I got all the gear that I want. Oh my god, dude, it's like glitching every single time I'm, like, walking and Fox is right behind me. Look at that. <laughs> Fox is just really, really big. Um, alright, Scribe Rothschild should be in this service. building somewhere. Down here by the map, I think? Okay, he's not by the map, but he's around here somewhere. There he is. What's up, bro? Well, it's good to see that you're on your feet again. Thank you. I assume Lyons is immediately throwing you to the wolves? I mean, you're not wrong. Has he told you what's been going on while you've been resting? Nope. Well, not really. I've learned a little bit, but I was hoping you could tell me a little bit more. Yes, I believe I can. Step over here for a moment, will you? Don't tell me what to do. Okay, yes. <laughs> Where are we going? Oh, man. I love this game. This is arguably probably my favorite Fallout game. I struggle between this one and Fallout New Vegas, but I have more nostalgia for this one. happened over the last few weeks and what's going on now? As you well know, this all began with the Enclave's occupation of Project Purity here. Thanks to you, their main headquarters here was utterly destroyed. Good. They then suffered a second defeat at the Purifier. Also good. A combination of intelligence and field report. Other enclave locations throughout the wasteland were found. Cut off from their leadership, it was expected that their forces would be in complete disarray. This is not been the case. Okay. Based on data and tech gathered from these locations, we've determined that the enclave forces are still maintaining remote communications. We isolated the transmissions and found their origin point. An old military installation in Rockland, the southwest. Our nice. 
scouts have checked over the area, but no easy access to the facility was found. So we're making our own access point. Paladin Tristan is leading the team setting up a forward base in an old car tunnel near the site. Once he's set, Liberty Prime will be deployed. Prime's directive is to neutralize awesome. the defenses and create an entry point for the team. The team will move in, eliminate any opposition inside, and cut off their transfer. Any relevant data should be brought back here. Now, did you have any other questions? I mean, you pretty much summed it up. Hold on, let's talk to him and see if we can get some more information. Like to know, I'll tell you what I can. Otherwise, Paladin Tristan will be waiting. I'll alert him that you're on your way. Uh, how's Liberty Prime holding up? That last battle was pretty intense. Performance is exceeding all our expectations. He's been especially effective against the Enclave's vertebrates, for which we previously had no counter. We are fine-tuning his programming as we go, but on the whole, I'm pleasantly surprised. Well, that's good. It's as I always suspected. Prime's real issue was energy management. And when Dr. Lee helped us solve that problem, well, <laughs> the rest was easy. Good. Uh, let's find out what's going on with the purifier. It was determined that the Brotherhood should directly oversee the purifier, as so as to prevent any mishaps. Scribe okay. Bigsby was placed in charge of the operation and is directly overseeing our efforts. Is that all? Okay, yep, that's all the information that he has for us. So I guess we're going to that said military installation. Ah, man, I get so confused in these places. I think it's up. Hail. You honor us with your presence here. Thank you. I think I'm going to have to get rid of Welcome. Fox, unfortunately. It kind of glitches out when he's directly behind me. And I don't really like that. All right, let me, let's test it out again. Yeah, see, I... I mean, I guess I could do this. Yeah, I guess I'll walk in first person. That sucks, but whatever. It is what it is. Whoops. I always forget that the things are backwards. So, looks like we're going to the Citadel. Do you want to travel to the Citadel? Absolutely. Let's go rain on some enemies. Wait a minute. Wait, hold on. Where, where was I? I was Oh wait, I'm I'm at the Citadel and I need to go way down there. Oh. Well, let's forget that ever happened. You guys didn't see anything. This is the closest place to Oh yeah, I forgot about that tower. I haven't even been there yet. I probably should at some point. That's a uh, uh what's the name? Tenpenny Tower. Alistair Tenpenny. This is probably one of the best environments in a Fallout game, in my opinion. You really do feel, ever since you like come out of the wasteland, or out of the vault into the wasteland, you literally feel like you're in a wasteland. Everything is all dilapidated and destroyed, and or irradiated. Even in Megaton, the first big major city that you get to, and it's it literally feels like a wasteland, you know, town. I really do love this game quite a lot the environment in this game is probably one of the best in my opinion in the fallout series and i don't know i i have a lot of nostalgia for this game too man i really really love this game oh i see a rat scorpion way over yonder are those bad guys one two is that is that a ghoul yes it's a glowing one good to know Who's he shooting at? Oh, Fox. Fox is honestly a monster. He is legitimately a monster. The only reason why I keep him is because... Wait a minute, where's dog meat? Yeah, I think, I think dog meat's gone. I'm not going to fight the glowing one. Wait, I think I might actually... Am I... Is this where I'm supposed to go? No. Still gotta go further, but I think I'm gonna have to cross the train yard. Look at him! I'm not even gonna get an opportunity to fight him. Alright, let's try it. 
Well, at least I got the final shot. Give me my XP. Let's loot his body and make sure there's nothing we could potentially use. Yep, see, like bottle caps. Could definitely always use a good, healthy supply of bottle caps. Even though there was just five. What's up, buddy? Dude, I just blasted his head off. That was sick. Uh-oh. Speaking of irradiated locations, this place is very irradi irradiated. I should probably get out of here. Fox will be just fine, though. Dog meat? I don't know. He's invincible, so he'll be fine. Me, on the other hand, not so much. Really wish I could play in third person, man. I kind of prefer it, to be honest. But with Fox here, he kind of like messes up the camera quite often. He's just a big boy, you know? Who are these guys? Ah, we got some raiders. Ah! Dude, that was disgusting. This pistol is seriously amazing. Aw, how cute. She's taking a nap. Finger, sure, why not? I could sell those later. Definitely could always use some more fingers. That just sounds weird to say. Hey, I destroyed some bad guys for you. Wall proof? Yeah, here's their finger. How do you identify them? Ah! Get away from me! Oh, oh, oh. To me? Fox, he was literally trying to kill me. What are you talking about? Put up a fight? Look, I'm still seeing blood on my face. Some might call me a disgrace. I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. Alright, hold well on. Let's kill homeboy over there. Hey, come back here. Did I get him? I'm pretty sure I didn't hit any of those shots. But you know what? It's okay. I'm still... I'm still alive. That's really all that matters. Oh, there's another big dude right over... Wait. Oh, we got a death claw. Uh-oh. I might have... Is he shooting at the death claw? At least I... At least I got the the, the uh, Yao Guai. Alright, now I know for sure I hit him. I don't want any of the stuff that's on them. It's probably just meat, to be honest. I don't really need meat. I'm not playing survival or anything like that, so... I don't need meat. I don't even need my own meat. I'd rather be an alien. This... What is this place? Is this... This definitely... Let's go... Activate the, the... There's another rad scorpion over there. Yeah, let's go... At least hit up the... Uh, the place just so that we can get that... Map marker location. Just in case we ever need to fast travel back over here. What's up, bro? Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. This guy's strong. Get away from me. Oh no. Fuck. I have you here for a reason. If you can't absolutely obliterate people, why do I have you here? Okay, you know what? I'm lying. I'm going to keep you forever. I really need to take a stim pack. Because uh, I'm definitely going to die here soon if I don't. I don't have that many. Oh, God. I, I need another one. I probably should have taken the medic perk. Uh-oh. Yes, fight Fox. See, this is a perfect opportunity. I wish we had dog meat with us, but I don't know where he's gone. He's always disappearing on me, dude. I don't know why. I guess he just doesn't like being around me. Alrighty. It's def definitely a different dog meat from Fallout 4, though. Because the one in Fallout 4 literally... Loves you so much, he never wants you to leave rooms because he's always, like, standing in the middle of the door. Blocking your way out. To be fair, though, this dog me does the same thing, except he likes to disappear on you quite often. 
Uh, case in point, right now. Ah! I hear somebody. Oh, it's just a stupid robot. The good thing about this is that he'll probably have some ammo for me. See? Just like that. Awesome sauce. I love energy weapons in the Fallout franchise, man. I really, really do. I wish in uh, Fallout 76 they didn't break so easily. Because those freaking weapons, energy weapons, man, I swear, you can't, you shoot like five rounds and that's it, it's over. Hey, what's up, man? Hey there. Hi. Hey, you're awake. All right. Paladin Tristan is just inside. He's waiting for you. Good. Can't wait to see Paladin Tristan. What are you looking for, Fox? You're literally doing the the gestures as if you're looking far away, but you're looking at this stupid lamp that's literally inches away from your face. How do, ooh. Ammunition box? Yes, sir. I don't need a dart, but I'll take it. More. Oh, five, five, six. Microfusion cells? Dude, I'm just, I'm getting all kinds of stuff here. Unfortunately, there wasn't anything in the locker, so there's that. Oh, wait. No, nah, I don't want no potato chips. Let's get out of here. Although they do give me food. I mean, uh, health when I eat food, don't they? I don't know. These turrets look weird. Look at this guy. This guy's just ready well, to fight. Well, oh, that's Tristan. Look who's back amongst the living. Some of us were starting to wonder if you and Sarah were going to pull through. Um, well, I did. Uh, Sarah Lyons, unfortunately, is still in bed. Uh, good to see you too, man. I'm here to help. Is that so? Well, it'll be good to have another soldier we can count on. That's good. Basic rule of thumb on these operations. Keep your head down and let the robot do most of the heavy lifting. He can take it better than you can. Um, what do you need me to do exactly? I need you to keep your head on straight. No heroics, okay? Liberty Prime was called in to assist with the initial assault. Once we've cleared ourselves a nice staging area, we'll reassess the situation. Come on, things should be underway by now. All right, I'm down. Let him do everything. What is this guy? It's been pretty oh, these are Enclave troops. Yourself. We get intel on positions, go in and burn them out. Dude, there's a bunch of Enclave armor. I think... I think I have a full set on me though, right? I might have put it at home. I might have taken it home, to be honest. I don't remember. The tin can does most of the work, honestly. I can't complain. It keeps our casualties down. Really? Scribes pulled information about this place day before yesterday. Some communications facility. Why does he not have a gun? Does Is he really going to go into combat with his fist? We're Come on, Paladin Tristan. We can Where's your rifle? Talking to and get the last of the locations nailed down. If you say so. Paladin Tristan is a G, though. Well, look at these guys. They're ready to go to battle. Oh, it's on like Donkey Kong. Look at these guys. They all have... Oh, snap! There goes Liberty Prime again. Oh god, oh god. Be nice to me. Look at him. Tell me Liber Liberty Prime isn't a G. Can I go up this way? I want to. Oh! What was that? Death is a preferable alternative to Look at him. It's kind of funny though, because I'm. I'm playing this DLC the day of the Super Bowl, which of course is like a week uh, ahead of you guys. Obviously, I recorded it in advance, but he's over here literally throwing Tom Brady shots over here. Engaging with Chinese aggressors. Well, I wonder who's gonna win. I don't know. Should be pretty interesting to say the least. Whoa, look at this guy's leg. Microfusion cells. I'll take... Hold on, let me see my... Okay, yeah, I'm gonna take this plasma rifle. 
to fix mine. So let's go to weapons. Uh, this one. Then repair for this plasma rifle. Bingo. Now my plasma rifle is a little bit better. Look at him. Look at him. Oh. This guy survived. And then he got blasted with that sight. Oh, there he goes again. Alrighty then. We absolutely obliterate him. Good job, Liberty. Look at him. Fist of steel. Satellite oh, hi, Tristan. Oh my god. <laughs> That's amazing. Everyone's blasting their way in there. Warning. Let's search these troops. Oh, yeah. Chinese orbital strike. All right. Uh oh. All personnel should reach minimum safe distance. Uh oh. Immediately. Run away before he gets blown up. Oh snap! Oh my god. Initiative two, six, eight, two, his, his head two, just blew up. Zero, nine, I die <laughs> so that democracy may be Aww. Poor Liberty Prime. He's his head literally exploded. Absolutely exploded. I feel bad for him actually. Not really, he's just a robot, but you know what I mean. Alright, I'll definitely be taking that stim pack. Perfect. I should probably... I should probably use the plasma rifle. Because there's plasma rifles everywhere. Yeah, I think this is probably the best bet. Since we're like with the Enclave, we're going to be getting plasma rifles like crazy. See what I mean? Case in point. Let me make sure my plasma rifle is at tip-top shape. I get scared of doing this because I don't want to destroy a good weapon that I need. Alright, so this guy has a laser rifle. Let's actually... Uh, Yeah, let's... Can I... Yeah, okay, so I can't do that. But I could do this. And I will. The laser rifle is pretty cool too, though. We need to find out oh. what the hell just happened. I'm talking to a pipe. There's no time to talk. Get your ass inside that base and help the troops locate the source of their transmission. Now, soldier, now! Uh... Um... What am I looking for? I don't know, I don't know. Terminals, data, anything that can help us figure out what just happened. Where it came from. Okay. Thank you for talking to me, pipe. It's a good conversation we had there. All right, let me take another plasma rifle just in case. Yeah, look. Uh, yeah, this is... Oh, my repair skill's at 99. So this should... Yeah, this is pretty much at full health. Let's go ahead and do all of that. Okay, so both of them have been searched. I just don't know where I'm supposed to go at this point. At least I don't remember it's been a really long time uh oh duh maybe the only door in the vicinity let's go aim for the face Ooh. that was that was absolutely disgusting oh wait there's more of them I, yeah, I like vats, but the vats in these old Fallout games takes a really long time to initiate, unfortunately. Finger! That's how you know uh, that the Enclave is bad in this game. Because they drop a finger, which is such a weird thing to say, but it's true. Alright, you know what? I'm going to do two over here. And then... Oh, this guy has Hellfire Power Armor. Look at that. Oh, dude, they're shooting me right in the chest. Oh, 
that was that angry face. Did you see me? Encourage my brother. Absolute G over here. Man, I forgot how exciting this DLC is. It's literally, literally been years since I've played this game. Or this DLC, period. Actually, we should probably check these, huh? Nah, there's nothing in there. Oh, God, getting out of here. Okay, I was going to say, getting out of here is going to be a pain, but apparently not. Perfecto changeo. What are we doing? Get away from me. Haha. -ha. Oh, there's still someone else? There is. I'm pretty sure I just shot my own friend. To be fair, though, that's his own fault. He ran right in front of me. He's tr over here trying to be a hero. And then he got blasted himself. Oh, well. I don't feel bad. Where are they shooting at? Get out of the way. Perfect. This guy's rolling down the stairs. <laughs> He's rolling down the stairs. That's hilarious. Oh, no. We got a Brotherhood of Steel Paladin that's dead. Well, I mean, can you blame him? He was only carrying a 10 millimeter pistol. What are you going to do with a pistol? A 10 millimeter pistol at that. What happened to your laser weapon? Don't worry, I'll carry you guys. Where are they? Oh, hello. Dude, I just shot his... Wow, that guy was... That guy was tanky. Uh, no Gatlin laser. What's up, bro? Ready for some awesome face shots? Good night. Dude, my build is pretty legit. Oh! I got shot. Where are you? Oh. I can't shoot him, dude. Now these guys are probably gonna... There we go. Perfect. No. I want a face shot. Um, yeah, that'll do it. That would definitely do it. What happened to the... Hey, be more careful. Okay, well, never mind. Um, let's go ahead and take some of these. Dude, this is a pretty exciting DLC. I totally forgot how exciting it was, actually. Let's go ahead and uh, use a couple of... Actually, we'll take... We'll take two more, just to get near top health. Alright, where am I going, though? I'm so confused right now. I'm so confused. Alright. Well, once again... Maybe through the only door that's in the vicinity. I swear, I need to be a little Retreat. bit more observant. Haha! <laughs> Y'all, you're not retreating, Enclave Scientist. You're gonna get shot in your back. I'm about to commit some war crimes. Where did the one that was over here go? Oh. God. Oh, no, wait. Goo pile. That's who I'm looking for. Coming. Thank you, Goo Pile. Know we were coming? I don't know. That's a good question. You tell me. How did they know you, we were coming? <gasps> oh, dude, you're so screwed, bro. How dare you run in here all by yourself? What is this guy doing? Why do they always stand in front of me when I'm trying to shoot them? I'm... That's not... No, that's... Oh, God. All right. Let's... I had hoped you'd return. Let's get going. With all due haste. There we go. One more for the that was... Pretty bad, actually. I didn't want to dismiss Fox, but... I did, unintentionally. Look at him. He's taking a nap. Good night, buddy. I gotta get all the ammunition possible. Hey, what's up? Are you ready to get a face full of plasma? Excellent. Now he just turned into a bunch of goo. I almost missed you. Hello. And goodbye. Dude, I'm literally gooifying everybody that I kill. It's pretty spectacular, actually. Dude, I'm going to be rich after this with all the fingers I'm getting. Out of all the fingers, I hope it's the middle one. Just because it's funny. 
Uh, do I go further down? It looks like it. Oh, wait. Or is it? I don't know. Let's check it out and see. Can we take a nap here? We found a uh, Enclave Power Armor Helmet. Ooh, I'll take that to fix up my laser rifle. Yas, please. And, uh, and it is officially fully uh, maxed out in health. So, I mean, that's a good thing with this DLC and my specific load. Load out. Oh, God. Oh, Get out of my way. Okay. I'm running straight to the back. Yeah, I get, like, unlimited... What am I aiming at? I get unlimited, uh... You know, weapons to fix up my, my personal weapons. Out of this. It's pretty amazing. Dunzo. Dude, they're all dead. My guys are honestly pretty OP, dude, when you really think about it. They're like walking through all these guys like it's nothing. Uh, microfusion cells. Let me go around and make sure I get the other guy too. Before? Oh, yes, definitely. See, I need stim packs, man. I really do need stim packs. That's something I need to buy every time I get an opportunity. I'm not lacking in the ammo department or anything like that. What I'm lacking is stim packs, and I absolutely need them. What's in here? Shotgun shells? Sure, why not? Look at all these boxes. Ammunition boxes at that. Energy cells. Microfusion cells everywhere, dude. I'll take it. Absolutely take it. Oh, I thought that was a person, but it wasn't. I was about to say, why isn't he attacking me? Oh, those are... Oh, God. What's up, bro? Let's go. Oh, God. Juco. Oh, dude, I really thought I almost died, but I was looking at their, at their health instead of mine. Really, guy? Okay, well, since you guys are so ready to fight, I'll let you guys take care of them. Since you guys just want to jump in. No, get. Oh my god, Fox. Enclave soldier. Man, I really gotta hone in and make sure I'm getting the right thing because I seem to keep talking to Fox more than anything. What are they shooting at? Literally, no one's shooting anything. I got. I got a bug, apparently. Hopefully this doesn't persist. Oh my god. Get me out of here. Oh my god. That is so <laughs> annoying. Yeah, there's definitely some sort of a bug. I'm probably gonna save it and reload. Ah! That's close. It's definitely one of the Brotherhood people that's behind me. Or maybe it's Fox. I don't know. Hopefully reloading. Okay, good. That, that fixed the problem. Do I have to go back in there? Yes, I do. The good thing is... Where am I supposed to go, though? Huh. Watch it be the only door again. Well, they're in here, so... Oh, that's what. Duh. Uh, update standing orders. Remain unchanged. Okay, request new telemetry data. Uh, download. Yes. Data downloaded. Uh... Uh, unauthorized. Okay, well, I mean, I guess that's the only thing. I can. Let's double check and make sure. Yeah, that's everything I could do. So let's go ahead and go back out. I think we have to go talk to Scribe Rothschild again. I think that's what that said on the quest update. And I think that's what this exit was. It's just for you to go outside to the fast travel. Yeah, you, 
you can see Tenpenny Tower from here. We were all the way over there one at one point. All right, let me see. Whoops, that was an accident. The Citadel. What? There's enemies. Oh, the Death Claw. Go ahead and handle your business, Fox. Fox is honestly a little OP. Alright, let's see. Okay, there we go. We can finally travel to the Citadel. I guess it's pretty safe to put that away now. I should have gotten another plasma rifle though, so I could put it back to full health or condition. I mean, I, to be fair, I don't really need it. I didn't really... I don't really need Welcome. it, but... What are they... Oh, they're practicing. I was about to say, what are they shooting at? Look at them doing their push-ups. These guys are squaring up over here. I really like it. You know what would be amazing? Having a remake, or not even a remake, but a remaster of Fallout uh, 3 and New Vegas. That would be... Oh, that would be so perfect in my opinion. So, so perfect. What's up, Scribe Rothschild? I just, How you been, homie I G? I can't believe it. All those years of work, all of it. For what? One botched operation? Yep. I'm still waiting on the debriefing from Tristan, but I'm not sure it even matters. With Prime gone... Um... Uh, could have been worse. They could have attacked the Citadel. Hopefully I found something that can... Yeah, hopefully I found something that can help you. I don't know what could help at this point. If anything, we should be thankful they waited this long to use... Whatever they used. Nonetheless, we should try and move on. What is it you have for me? Uh, I found this thumb drive. <laughs> Actually, this is probably good. I found some encrypted data at the relay station. Um, some kind of data. Yeah, that doesn't help. Uh, maybe you can focus on analyzing this data instead of... Oh, whoa. Yeah, I found some encrypted data at the relay station. Ah, yes. Well, I'll see if we can't figure out how to read it. Perhaps it can give us some insight as to just what happened out there. It would be good to salvage something from this mess. Thank you for bringing this to me. I believe Elder Lyons will want to speak with you as well. Perhaps you should find him. If you'll excuse me. You're excused. You are excused. Where is Elder Lyons? He's in hey. the other building, right? All right, so we got to go back upstairs then. What? Fox, how the hell did you teleport in front of me, bro? You got to teach me how you do that. I would love to teleport wherever I want. That scared me, actually. Look at that. Look at what? Magic. Pure magic. Fox is amazing. That's why he's the best companion in Fallout 3. Look at all these bottles of water. It's amazing. It's an amazing day when the Brotherhood has control of all the water. <laughs> hey, what's up, man? Hey, yo. Long time no see. I feel like I'm going in circles. Of Dog meat, is this you? Is this where you've been the whole time? Come on, boy. Uh... All right, good. So where is... All right, there. Finally, he's following me. I guess this time he didn't disappear. He just left. Is this what I think it is? Look at hey, Maxon. Stranger. I am Squire Maxon, royal servant of steel. It is an honor to make your acquaintance. Uh, relax, Squire. I don't bite. I plead for your pardon if my behavior offends you, sir. We don't get many visitors in the Citadel. The brothers and elder lions are excellent teachers. But I get nervous about the protocols. The Codex says that outsiders are not to be trusted. Shield yourself from those not bound to you by steel. For they are the blind. Aid them when you can, but lose not sight of yourself, it says. Uh, understandable. Uh, <laughs> good, your fear pleases me. <laughs> That's so evil. Understandable. I met, I've met a lot of dangerous people myself. It's not simply the outsiders that we are wary of. Anybody who has not taken the oath of fraternity is suspicious to us. 
The Codex says, Fear those who do not pledge to the Brotherhood, for though their eyes may be open through service, they are now blind. But it also tells us, Give way your suspicions to the wisdom of thine elder. Where he shows trust, so shall you. Elder Lyons trust you, so you are free to stay here. <laughs> yes, sir. One day you will be Elder Maxon, by the way. Uh... Let me see. Okay, well, see you later, Maxon. May we speak again soon? The, the little squire Maxon. Uh, thank you. Hey, Elder Maxon, how you doing? I trust you've spoken lions. with Rothschild. I did. I hope you can make some headway with the data you've recovered. With me our too. primary weapon destroyed, we risk losing our momentum and jeopardizing the entire campaign. I must admit, I now wonder whether moving ahead with this operation was an error in judgment. Uh, potentially, I guess? Uh, you couldn't have known this uh, would happen. No one knew. Yeah. And yet, here we are. And yet, here we are. Discounting the fact that our best field commander is in a coma, and I personal feelings for my daughter, things have not gone well. If we fail now, we could lose everything. Uh, we have kept fighting. We can't back down now. Uh, everyone here believes in you and the brother, okay, blah, 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 blah. Yes. Yes. I sincerely hope you are right. If we are to succeed now, it will once again be largely thanks to you. Paladin Tristan has requested you for a special assignment. Please, report to him at once. We've little time to waste before the Enclave seizes this opportunity. Good to know. See you later. Pale. Isn't there... Isn't there a special weapon in here? I think there's a special weapon in there. I don't quite... See, he's got the good. He's trying to take it. Cold Hail. So, uh, as you were. Yes. All right. Well, I can't. I can't get in there, anyways. Now, I mean, how are we supposed so to where finish are we off going? the enclave? The operation wasn't a total loss. If we can make sense Let's make our way out of here so we can finally get to our final destination. I just don't. It's. I'm not gonna lie. It's kind of hard for me to maneuver my way around Hail. here. I always forget where the exit is. Need something, friend? Um. Courtyard. Or am I supposed to... What, okay, what's my mission? I guess that would help a little bit, huh? Speak with Paladin Tristan. Alright, so where is the homeboy? He's in here. Oh, he's right here. What am I doing? Nice work back there. Let's hope the scribes can do something useful with the information you retrieved. Unfortunately, we don't have time to sit around and wait for the analysis. Based on what I've seen of you so far, there's an assignment I believe you're well suited for. Um. Yeah, what do you need? With the setbacks the Brotherhood has suffered, we find ourselves in a difficult position. All our available resources need to be positioned for the inevitable counterattack from the Enclave. At the same time, we believe we may have developed a tool to help our chances of victory. But with everyone needed to help defend against the Enclave, we have no one to send on a recovery mission. So, I'm going to have you travel to the only power works to secure some tech for us. Uh, what's there? Hopefully you'll be able to find a Tesla coil, an experimental device from before the war. Our scribes need it to complete a little surprise they've been preparing for the Enclave. Get there, get the coil, and get back as safely and quickly as possible. Any questions? Uh... Is there anything I could have? Uh, let's see what this guy says with this. Olney, old Olney is da is a dangerous place. Is there anything I could have to help me? Check with Scribe Valencourt. She's been researching some of the Enclave technology we've recovered. From what I understand, she may have come up with something. All right, later. I'll be waiting for that Tesla coil, if you can find one. Good to you honor us with know. Your Where am here? I? No, that's not the way. O M G. So, 
Get out of my way. What's on your mind? There we go. I'm trying to stay positive. Let's go ahead and go. Hey, you honor us with your presence here. Why, thank you. So something is in here. World map. So first of all, this is Vault 92. All right, this is probably just the exit, huh? Hail. Yeah, Capital Wasteland. All right, so uh, you know what I should have done while I was here? Rested. Actually, you know what? Since the loading screens are pretty fast. What does that say? Airing? I don't know. Let's look for the barracks real quick. We'll take a quick rest just to get our health all the way up and we don't have to use our... Okay, you know what? I'm just going to go in. That way I don't have to use up any of my stim packs. Let's just hope I find a bed I'm able to sleep in. Oh, some beds over here. Yeah, 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 I can sleep here. Excuse me. Excuse me, coming through. Paladin Glade, nice to see you again. Paladin Tristan, long time no see. Literally, it's been like a minute. All right. You honor us with your presence. Yes, you say that every time. Thank you. Uh, what's the closest place to there? Minefield or Wheaton Armory? Regular HQ, Temple of the Union, Cranberry Commons. I guess we can go to Minefield. The only thing that scares me about Minefield is, I mean, literally, it's full of mines. So I gotta be a little careful. I think I might have already taken most of the landmines that are here. But, I mean, let's be real here. I'm pretty sure I left some behind. So I gotta still be careful regardless. But I think I'm good. Look at it. There's nothing here. I did a pretty good job sweeping this place. Haha, -ha, mine sweep. Need to... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Run away. Well, that almost backfired. I'm over here talking about how good I did at sweeping up the place and quite the opposite was that because I almost literally got my legs blown off. Luckily, there's a bed up there that I could sleep in. So, I guess it would have been fine because I don't think a landmine would have killed me. Let me make sure dog meets with me. Yes, he is. Oh, God. Run! Oh, there's mines everywhere. I hope I don't get either of my companions dead or killed. I don't know what I'm talking about. Wait, hold on. What's over there? Oh, yeah. I gotta... That would have been to talk to what's-her-name, huh? Crap. Do I need it, though? Well, we're... Okay, what we're gonna do is... We'll... We're gonna find a... Potential fast travel point around... Alright, this is the closest thing that I can think of. We'll activate this place... So, and then we're going to run back because I do want to talk to that lady just in case there's anything special that she could potentially give us. Because, who knows, maybe it is something we need and it'll make our mission a little bit easier. But, to be honest, I don't think it's anything special. But it won't hurt to check, I guess. What is this called again? MDPL-13 Power Station? Okay, so let's go back to the Citadel just very quickly hope it's something good doubt it but I hope it's something good hey. all right where is it looks like it's literally straight across okay maybe we it's over here three dog Miss that, man. We should go say what's up to him at some point. Alright, so it's not that marker. It's this one. So he's going to be downstairs. Is it you? Oh, it's, it's a girl. I'm still very, very busy. Is this important or can it wait? Uh, I hear you can help me uh, get into Old Olney. Well, maybe. I mean, possibly. I think so, but I'm not certain. I don't know how much this will actually help. 
I mean, I'm not quite sure how effective it might be, since it hasn't really been field tested. But I uh -huh. think I've figured out a way to override the signals the Enclave is using to control their death claws. Ooh, yes. Here, take this. It's only a prototype, so please don't lose it. Uh, what is this thing? It's a semi-standard transmitter, only I altered the frequency modulation and jacked up the output. Based on some experiments I ran here in the lab, it should override the signals the Enclave uses to control death claws. Don't worry, it's constantly broadcasting, so you don't need to do anything. Just don't lose it. And so far, I have no evidence of adverse effects of EM interference in humans. Animals, maybe, but not humans. Anyway, it doesn't have a huge broadcast range, but it should be enough. Uh, how does it work? It overrides the Enclave signal, so as far as the Death Claw is concerned, you're in control. And remember, it works passively. As long as you have the Scrambler on your person, it'll do its job. Uh, is there anything else, uh, anything at all that I should be concerned about? No, I don't think so. As long as you're within range of the Enclave's transmitter, your signal should be the one the Death Claw follows. If you get too far away, well... I'm not sure what's going to happen. I think there might be some bad effects. Well, for the Death Claw, not you. I hope. All right, well, thank you. All right, then. There have been reports of an Enclave camp southeast of Old Olney, so I'd head there if you want to try it out. I hope the Scrambler ends up being useful. I'd hate to have spent all this time on it and get no results. Or bad results. That would be worse. All right, bye. Good luck. And please be careful. I will. So we're definitely gonna go to that optional portion. Hail. I think dog meat might be screwed because she said that uh, she doesn't know how it will work on animals. Pretty sure dog meat's an animal. Could be mistaken though. He might be, you know, an alien or something since he doesn't die. Well, he does, but still, you know what I mean. Okay, so we're gonna go to the optional location first. We should definitely take out the pit, the rifle, though. Wait, hold on. Okay, yeah, we almost went the wrong way. Dogby, what are you, what are you angry at? I don't know. This guy is not a bad. All right, good. It is an enclave I bought, though. I think that's old Olney right there, actually. So the thing with old Olney is that. It's got a ton of death claws there. Like, a ton. It's one of the scariest places in the game. There's scarier places for sure, but Old Only has a ton of death claws. If I remember correctly. Well, I think it's already been confirmed due to the nature of this mission, but you know what I mean. It's still scary. And this game's death claw situation is pretty horrifying dude i think although they look physically scarier in like fallout 4 and uh you know and fallout new vegas and stuff like, i mean in uh in fallout 4 and fallout 76 they're significantly scarier in like in actual application in fallout 3 and fallout new vegas only because in this game they travel in like packs I might have to use a uh, rat away. Actually, I'm, I know I'm going to need to use a rat away by the time I'm out of this place. Or maybe not. I don't know. I think we're good. What is that over here? Oh, God. Careful. Okay, there we go. I was actually scared that we weren't going to be able to I wasn't going to hit it all right we're finally out of the radiation zone that was a lot of radiation I was taking I'm surprised I didn't get absolutely you know uh, radiation I didn't get radiation poisoned oh dude I just shot dog meat in the face sorry dog meat how's your face bloody oh it's okay you'll be all right rub some dirt on it Dude, there's a lot more red scorpions over there. I don't care. I will obliterate them. Red scorpions. 
they don't really scare me that much in these games. They are pretty scary because they do have a lot of, like, uh, armor. But they're really not that bad. Whoa, what the hell just happened? Someone just blow up? I don't know. Wasn't one of my people. All right. What's the optional quest exactly? Uh, use Enclave Control de uh, Death Claws to your advantage. I don't even know how to use this thing, to be honest. Yeah, I got a pretty good reputation, Fox. Thank you for, uh, for that. Yeah, okay, so this is the camp right here. Hopefully... Oh, snap! He almost hit me. There's a ton of them. Alright, screw it. We're running in. Where are they? Where are they? Ah! You're so screwed there, bro. They literally didn't stand a chance. Easy enclave crate. Definitely grab those. Definitely grab those. Eh, I'm not gonna do that. This dude is literally gonna die with like one hit. And in the process, I also blew off his leg. Because why not? And I got another stim pack. Well, this guy over here, I believe, had a. I believe had a. Never mind. Somebody, I could have sworn somebody had a plasma rifle. Flame or fuel, okay, sure, why not? I'll take all of that. Why not? I don't know how to use this thing that I got. Do I have to use this computer? I really hate these things. Alright, let's get back out. Go back in. I'll get lucky eventually. Oh, there we go. Didn't take very long that time around. Yeah. Don't care about that. Plasma mine. Absolutely take that. Hold on. Where... Oh god. Oh, it's um, I'm already using it. Cool. He's my friend. Yeah, I guess that answers my question seen as uh scribe Illuminati or whatever her name was. She literally said that it's always broadcasting, right? So dude, I got a I got a friend Deathclaw. That's honestly pretty amazing. What is that? Wait. Wait, how did my... Now try and hide. Ah! I could have sworn they were supposed to be friendly. Scribe Illuminati lied to me. I demand a refund. Even though I got it for free. Damn it, I can't hit him. Fox, where are you going, dude? <laughs> Dog, we get over here. I don't know what I don't know what any of these guys are doing. Look at this guy. Dunzo, bro. Dunzo. Where are we? Why do I have two? Was I actually supposed to do something there? Okay, I'm I legitimately need to figure this out for future plays for me personally. I want to figure this out. So there's definitely something that I have to do over there at the camp. But I'm not sure what. I've literally never done this optional portion of the quest. I always go here, wipe them out and then literally leave. 
so I'm not sure. And I don't know what happened to that death claw that just died randomly. I thought he was supposed to be my friend. Then he just offed himself. All right, where is this? It's over here. But is there anything that we gotta do? Is there a computer or term or like a terminal or anything that I need to interact with? Hmm. Honestly, I don't know. Talk to Fox. Okay, whatever. If you guys know what I'm supposed to do with that optional quest, definitely let me know down in the comment section because I really legitimately have no idea. I would like to know. But I don't. So I guess now it's time to wipe out Ol Oli then. Obliterate these death claws from existence. I hope. At least that's the goal. I am pretty OP though, to be honest. I have like the weapons that I'm that I want, legit. And the armor that I want, and of course I got the companions that I want. Uh especially Fox. Fox is Fox is a monster. With his little mini gun. I think I gave him that mini gun though, but still, regardless. He's still a monster regardless. Both literally and figuratively. Alright, how do I get over there? Gotta go this way? I think there's like a manhole that I need to go down in. There we go. Jump! <laughs> Fox looks ridiculous. Ridiculous. Alright, let's go.